Death Row. Are you on meth, bro? Talk about peace. All you t care about is death, though. You serious? You want to fucking nuke Saudi Arabia? You want to nuke them? Yeah, dude, face it, man. You're not interested in peace. You're not interested in peace. If you want to go nuking people, that or you're just fucking cracked, man. You're so undercarb, you can't even fucking think logically. Like, I don't know what if you're doing like the paleo diet, like living out in the woods eating nothing but fish and fucking twigs or something. But you, you got to get switched on, man. And uh, think think about your personal power. This is like if if you're into nukes, you're a fucking fascist, hardcore. Not even a little bit. If you're into nukes, you are a straight up fascist. You are just like. Uh, one of those, like, like, you're just, I don't know, Donald Trump must have just sold you uh, on some some of his fucking brainwashing bullshit, dude. But, uh, you know, for obvious reasons, I, I guess I don't need to really get too deep into why that's a fucking insane idea. But I understand where you're coming from, because it's like, what else are we going to do? Uh, yeah, it, you know, there's so little personal power, apparently for human be for people but I can tell you know just by this one post you made about new in Saudi Arabia you're obviously not vegan you're obviously not vegan because if you were you'd have some hope for fucking humanity so um yeah and it uh, <laughs> so <laughs> I can tell like uh, just just face it man like you don't want to do the right thing you want somebody else to do it for you and uh the, the situation that you're trying to fucking promote is just gonna be like so disastrous and then so I go promoting veganism and somebody shits on me for it somebody calls me an idiot because I, I have the solution and you know oh no it's not gonna work if everybody goes yes it will no it's not yes it fucking will sorry there's no ifs ands or buts about it if you take on a philosophy of non-violence uh, uh, you know uh, uh, eliminating cruelty to as far of an extent as possible and practical to hu uh, sentient beings, human and non-human alike. If you take on that philosophy and that way of life, there cannot be war. Period. People calling me an idiot because people won't go vegan. Yeah, it's because people like you are too busy being like a victim, not, not wanting to take control of their lives and uh, not do, you know, uh, they're too busy doing that to do the right thing. And, and, and you know, just make the sacrifice, bite the bullet. Like, uh, you know, dude says, I, uh, I ought to learn how to hunt. It's like, but what about, like, participating in society? What about, like, when, uh, you know, when, when all that meat you ate, and let's face it, you didn't get fat from eating deer and, uh, you know, local f organic fucking lettuce or whatever. You got fat because you're going to the local stop and shop buying tortured fucking, you know, paying somebody else to torture and kill these cute little animals for you. And so... But anyway, they're just yeah, like you're you're not doing society any favors by going out and, and uh, shooting a cute little deer in the face. I mean, I usually don't go after people for like trying to su sustain themselves on wild food. But when you fucking uh, when you talk shit about the solution, the solution the to uh, the worst industry in the world, animal agriculture, and the solution to the psychotic fucking mentality, like the world isn't a shitty place because of people. The world is a shitty place because people are assholes and people don't believe in fucking peace. You know, people aren't willing to make the sacrifice. Uh, you know, you think you got more control over your personal safety than um, than you do world peace, which is false, man. You have no control over your personal safety uh, any more than you have control over world peace because a, a fucking, you know, if you're walking in the city, uh, a goddamn bomb could hit you any minute. So are you going to put out just like, the, you know, you think vegans are so pompous. You, uh, you think we're so arrogant because we're trying to do the right thing and we're trying to promote it. You think we're so arrogant. But you don't even have something to promote. You, you just want to go off into the woods. And if you want to go off into the woods, go off into the woods. You know? Show people how you live off the land and stuff. But don't be just like big fucking fat and then and then you get cancer and you're burdened on society you know and then what are you what are you gonna do like uh, reduce our health care costs man by not eating meat so yeah I usually don't go after people who hunt but when you're when you go out and, and talk shit about the solution big party foul man you know you're gonna fucking get it you're gonna hear it from us because that's our job 
as vegans we don't we we give people crap when they have when they have misconceptions I, I just don't know if you guys are like if you're missing some of the like facts or something like you seem like smart people I just don't get it you just you'd rather uh, anyway like don't fucking talk shit about the solution that's all you know it's basically what it boils down to um, yeah so not hating just saying have a nice day carb the fuck up do the right thing for the fucking planet and uh yeah, don't like don't think we're there. We're such pompous assholes when you think you you got the fucking solution and you don't even have anything to fucking say about it. You just rather just get your guns and fucking hide, you know? So fuck you. Peace.